Hello guys, welcome back to the Pokemon Gen 1 Monotype Challenge. This is Ice, and I'll be the final episode, although it may not be. We'll just see how these teams go, how well they are in my favour, because I'm really on the level right now. I do have an ask you know, which is OP, okay, but I'm only level 38. Just got it reasonably late, but only level 15. No, it was like 13 levels lower than me. Um, Lapras. Abra is not ideal first off, but lives anything. Oh, he waits an attack using exercise, man. Gee, brother! So, two obligatory trainers in here. It's the second. And we go and fight Giovanni. A lot of Pokemon around level 50. Uh, they could be tough, man. Uh, two Pokemon aren't two in this gym. They're just not ideal. They both would be strongest attack. Both are not incredibly high special. Charge a solar beam for this. I drip on point and even do that much. Nice. Even without the crit, the code. This gym is not obliging so far, man. With no physical moves, Chansey's a fucking nightmare. It didn't crit, slash. Holy shit, I froze it, yeah, boy. I'll just charge the solar beam then. No wreck. I'm not about to start. Miles beat me. Deal flat damage, but... Oh, he fucked guards first. What a bitch. Ooh, kill him. There's <laughs> this fucking vanilla. He's on a Marowak. He doesn't normally have Marowak, but ground. He's got his fucking Persian in the anime. Dangerous man. You keep wasting these turns, Geo. You fucking guard specs. <laughs> nice no, one. No! Fuck! I've got a side beam as well. Let's start. Uh, this is bad news. The rival on the turn to cruel. Fucking crit me, of course, it does it's fast. The rival on a fucking turn to cruel, and like. It had a. Uh, it had Thunderbolt, Thunder, and Thunder Bunch are like a level 20 odd. I only saw Mega kicking it now, so I won't bother setting up X Special. I'll try and see what Solar Beam does, but it is part poison, so it re might resist it. I don't know. Gem 1's weird, it seems to pick one side over the other. So it'll either be super effective or not very. I don't think it'll be neutral damage. Oh, missed. What did it convert to? Oh, I'll never know. Oh fuck off, you lucky bastard, man. I was gonna say, Starling's not too bad. What I feared mainly was Psychic lowering me special. Special attack and defense are combined in this gen, so if it lowers your special, it's like double whammy basically. Make me more susceptible to special attacks and my ones to deal less. Never did find drill pack. Um so I'm only hitting through special. Oh missed Blizzard twice in a row on page in these fights. It gets a crit, I'm so unlucky man. Again, it's fast, so it's Starmie, so they're quite like it's a crit, but where are my crits? Where's the gun man? I'm getting fucking knocked. I 
I doubt Mega Kick will one shot me. That's a crit me. Of course it crits. Of course. Why am I not fucking surprised, man? Ah, uh, just waste the potion. Nice! That's really good, actually. It can only get, get stuck into rage now. I'll use one X special. Wow, he just nerfed its moveset, man. If he kept all the thunder moves. Uh, rage will only rise when I hit it. I think one solid might do, actually. I'll save up on the X special. Oh, shit. Rage got more powerful then. Not a great deal, though. If it just goes up each turn, you hit it. So, like, if it was 10 hits, it become like, 10 times as powerful by then. You know what I mean? I kind of needed it to use Rage then. I'm not going to lie. Even with the X-Special, it took two solar beams with four moves. And he's teaching me Rage. Not a chance in hell I'm teaching that, brother. It can be useful, don't get me wrong. I wouldn't discredit it completely if you do set it up. Um. To be fair, it's, yeah, it's worth keeping all of them. If I can find, say, in Elite Four, the first Pokemon also Weedle, and it's only ever dealing like two damage with like a tackle or some shit, I could set up a monster hard rage for like the rest of the team. But then I guess all it takes is a Gengar to come out to like cut me. You can get soft locked with rage, actually. There's a way. So, just level 41, guys. Take it on the rival. I will see what this TM is. Come on, drill pack up Thunderbolt or something, man. That's too much stuff already. What's this one? <laughs> it's Toss Eye Lake. Submission, no, I don't really need that. So, he will have a Zomastar still. He loses it for the champion fight. It's happened every save. He'll end up with a Lapras. Um, but that's all the beam to do with both of them. Question is, can I afford to charge it? So I'd literally rather have had Razor Leaf, to be honest. But I never did find it. <laughs> Hello, Magic Garden. You're gonna do fuck all to me. Good team so far for me, man. God, perfect team, man. Yeah. I just like this from fucking jumping battle. <laughs> it's gonna be a lot harder. Maybe about 20 levels short. But I do have a load of excitements. Might have to actually use them for the first time. It's fucking fun, it's me, you little bit. It's just annoying, man. It just wastes time. There we go, though. One solar beam, of course, destroys it utterly. It's four times weak to grass. The most powerful grass move. On a Pokemon with OP special as it is. And we're through. GG. So, it's the last fight. Before the Elite Four. I'm going to be level 42. Taking on the Elite Four, boys. Oh my god. Is it possible? The problem with such a low level. Mike had the exact same thing, actually. He had a Zapdos. In one of these runs that was the same level, I think, about 42 going into uh, the Victory Road. I'm not going to be able to repel past a lot of stuff. I think they're all level 42's in and that's the highest actually, so if I'm close to level 43. Have a look. Yeah, kind of. It might be worth just killing some wilds to get to level 43 and being able to repel through them. Stuff will appear as well that I can't rip repel past. Um, 
soon as we're here, guys, to be fair. So I don't want to go on my way to show you the birds, but I might as well get it. You never know, I might be ice. Ooh, he first knife. Save state. I'll try and kill her for the XP anyway. It is ice! No way, boys, yes! No, this could be fucking useful in the end. I've got to get all the meat, Master Ball. Cloyster is here. <laughs> yes. What are the odds, man? There's only five ice Pokemon on the whole fucking gen. Nice. The only problem is I've got no TMs. I could go back. I could fly back to Celadon and find it some. I can get it Ice Beam at least. Give an echo to Cloyster. Uh. In a shell. I'll call him Sheldon. Oh, that was an insane find. Oh shit, he, he comes right in the scene, but. Not what it got then. Blizzard withdraw, ice beam, ice punch. Better about as good as you could hope for. I can teach it surf over punch. I have to get out of my PC. It's HMO free. Uh, but the withdrawal thing is cool because the, the beauty of um, Cloyster is it's it's mainly through attack and defense that you see it's insane stats there. Specials actually kind of won. Um, but say if like I come into or not, I can't do it, but I'm on the star or something like that. Oh shit. I don't want to fight this guy. Oh well, for XP again. I mean, he could actually kill me at my current level. That's not an ideal start. Neither is that! Fucking hell. I'm missing these blizzards. Uh, probably about to joke. That was just fucking bad here. Yeah, um, somewhere like a Persian, they'd be really good to fire out close So I might play the Elite Four with them. Um, Shift on. I think that's the only way to do it, really. I don't think I can hope to go through it. Oh, it's a Kuna, not have a tough time. So, yeah, it might be the first time where it is, like, pretty much a team effort. Uh, I fucked up that. Anyway. I need to push this over there. Nice girl, not to that point for now, so she'll be able to repel us. Sure. Speak of the devil. to run from Hypno. Well, I'll have a 43 in her as well. Fuck off. Oh my god! Will I be able to run from this with anything? Nice. But well, fuck me, yeah, if we're doing the electric run, boys, holy shit. Level 45 Zappos, just a dilly four. How nice that would have been. So for sure I should get uh, on uh, Oyster. Never even needed the water stone yet. I was holding on to it in case it bumped into a shell though. Well I did and we looked where it was to be fair. It's kind of like a sketch play. Oh, I couldn't learn any of these TM. Well yeah, but are they useful? Let's see. It knows rage and has insane defense. Yeah. This could be the play, honestly. I'll teach it Rage, for sure. Rage with Draw combo. Oh my god. It's kind of like... broken. No, I'm gonna save, save this. I'll get rid of... Ugh, pains me to do this. Get rid of Ice Beam. I do all Ice Beam is move. I don't have seven Blizzards, but... Rage might be the way to go. Uh, Submission I'm gonna toss. And pull out 
Say it again, screw it. I'll just go in as I am. Can I do it? A level 43. More than likely. I might need to. Ooh, yeah, okay. Straight away. I think I'm gonna reload. Ooh. Okay, maybe not. It will have to be Cloyster and a nose Thunderbolt. That's Cloyster's downside. If it was vanilla, my champ wouldn't be a problem at all. Um. Just close to get out of bed by my chum. I feel like... I think it might be close up here. Even then, to be fair, I need to, like, buy time. Buy set up rage. And withdraw, so... Yeah. It's probably silly. Oh, I froze it. Nice. Uh, sorry guys, just taking a drink. In that case, I'm just gonna sell. I'm not asking you. But it doesn't have bad moves, so it probably still has better stuff. Say the same again. Oh, shit, they didn't fight. Oh, I don't like doing it in fight. Apologies, guys. Oh, that's special. Uh, why? It's being killed or not. Two X specials. I probably. Oh, yeah, I should have saved some for like the harder fights. That boat should have bought more because that's what we want. I don't know. We should just bought as many as like a uh, lot 10 each. So I'll carry on. I'm not going to save state to before Bruno because I feel like. Ooh, I have a poke flute actually. Good. Always keep the poke flute, guys. Just a free awakening. First time I've had to use it actually since uh, in one of these runs. I've picked it up. You just keep spamming super potions. I <laughs> mind that at all. Just didn't psychic me. But yeah, like I said, I'm not gonna say stay before Bruno because I reckon I could have done that fight even with one X special to be honest. I probably didn't need one. Because that fucking thing would have just kept on me asleep. It's a mine. So I'll see Primates moves. So, oh, Shelly's all first again. Got. Right. Use next defense. No, no Razor Leaf. Oh. The X defense don't matter, but yeah, they go Shelly. He survived. Trooper. It speeds it. Mid Special is obviously better than I give it credit for. Unless Primates is just really trash. Probably the last one, to be honest. I'm going to go speed. Yeah, yeah, new one. But it's out back to the fence, so it's not too bad. Oh. Oh, uh, it's charging Solar Beam, you fucking mug. I'll do fuck all of you. Speaking of, I'm so scared on that. Bro, I can do this fight by special so far. Could be scary though. Nice. You keep spamming that. Oh yeah, easy. Easy man. 
I think I will just save stay at this point. I, I use no X Titans on this motherfucker. Kill the boys. Shelly back off. Again, I'll just try and leave. If, even, if I can't set up a rage, I'll do it. Just every cunt has a special move, man. It's nature randomizer, I guess. Uh, that, I only have three hyper potions. I guess I have nine full resources. What the fuck? I mean, it quietly, to be fair, but well, I haven't even really needed Charlie so far. Just try to rage straight off of it. No, it hits me with a special attack, it's gonna decimate me. Rage is built. Fucking poison powder is the worst thing we could have done, honestly. Ooh, Jinx. Jinx is kinda terrifying. Me attack fell, for fuck's sake. I was actually perfect, I just spam an Aurora Beams. Look at Shelly go though, yes yeah, that. It's just... Building it off nicely, to be fair. It's getting crit. It's just that poison, it's a shame it poisoned me. Jinx had nothing to do with Shelly, I put a set up on it. What could it be? It's fucking plowing through the mud. Yes yeah, that. It did its job man, it got rid of the Jinx. Pretty ominous for Articuno. Nice. I was worried that's a lot. Drowsy again. Fuck off. This would have been a dream, man, to have out against Cloyster if it came out earlier. Locked into Frash. If it just kept spamming spe super effectives, let it confuse itself. It's gonna build me rage. So, do I even need to set up X specials, or can I get me rage shot? I would have potentially breezed through that team then, if I didn't get poisoned. But the Jinx was out first. Nah, uh, it's gonna have an electric move and I'll one shot me. Solar Beam will destroy me as well. The fact it didn't fire out an electric move though is promising for Articuno. Might as well reload that. Uh, I think I'll try and fire out. The most important one's probably X Speed. And hopefully it starts charging. Oh, god damn, man. Even with a full heal, I don't think me speed's fixed. It's just gonna spam in it. Uh, fuck you. Falling away is one of the worst things I've ever seen on this one, honestly. It's nice though. I don't mind it mega kicking me at all. I can just carry on setting up. Yeah, next defend now. I can always pull restore and to kill it. Well, I'll do a thing. Maybe one more XP. 3 2 3 for blue would be enough. Do I kill it now? Or pull restore? I'll probably just spam on the way. It depends what it does this turn. Fuck off. How's he know, man? 
whatever. Yeah, of course it's dead, it's dead. I'll just use another full heal in a sec. Depends what's up next, but Fable... Hmm. I've got extra fangs, it's more than like you're gonna hit me physically and not do a great deal. I'm worried about the body slump Oh, Okay. A crit is my worst nightmare as well, because, um... It will bypass any increase that bad. Uh, it did have to recharge. Well, one shot this for Blizzard, for sure. How? Did I not spawn X specials? Are you serious? I did fuck all. What the hell, man? Oh, man. Blastoise walls make completely fuck. This is why I want an electric move on. This beam is super effective. I don't understand that. Did I use that special? Is that all I feel? Is that how shit I am? In terms of. No, only 10 levels below them. Nice though, it's fun. It's me a free kill. Defo needs heal on Sudra. It's a self solar beam. Nice, not bad. Nice, it's not going to crash now though. To be fair, this got two shot me. If it crits, this one. Oh my god! It's not dead! Fuck! He's gonna use a heal as well now, Lance, I think. Oh, he's locked in, so nice. Yeah, it's dead. Oh. It's gonna be confused, they'll probably all get another solar beam off. Nice. Oh my word. Well, GG. I'm gonna have to report. I'd only use Amber, it'll still deal a lot. I just have to spam Sir. They've got my specials in. Nice, man. My god, it's not like a flame throw or something. I'm banned, but... I'll do it. I'll take another shot. Yeah, I'll just... Revive. Oh, I lost all my boost, though. I'm never gonna speed again. Might be able to finish off with Shelly to be fair. Oh, fuck you, Lance. Yo. See how I'm dealing that much damage? It's like my specials did nothing, man. It's weird. I think he's been nerfed and nicked with a glitch in this game again. I have a way through, but... I did feel like me, Altacuno, wasn't doing enough. I used two X specials, I think. If not three. Oh, I could rare candy, actually. And save and I revive. It's close to level not, but it's the last fight anyway. Still got 14 revives. And we're not potions, though, is on a problem. Definitely should have bought more. Yeah, I want to have three full restores. Four. One for each of my team. It's better to just revive it, I think. Then level up. Just rotate spam and revive some, but it's it's gonna be really hard to sell. I don't think I can even afford to full heal the Shelly. I need to use me save me full restores to uh Altacuno. I should have saved it before that heal, but I'll do it now. Two left. Is it enough time to sell? Hopefully his first Pokemon out is one. I know the last one's gonna be the last for us. Oh he's <laughs> I gave him an armor star, he's got an armor knight. I need to set up and pull off a fucking thingy. Uh, solar beam, yes. You keep using water gun, man. That does fuck all to me. Nice. I'm gonna use... I'm gonna literally use all of these items. I probably only need a few at speed, but you never know if it might come out. Like fucking... Electrode or something. Let's just see if they actually fucking work this time. Like. 
So I still feel like I was dealing whatever damage I should have been dealing. Nice though. This should be easy to breathe through now. It did do less than I thought it special. It's damage. So nice. Probably didn't need, don't need another X speed. Probably I'll speed everything, but might as well fire it in. Thank you, Ammonites. You're a perfect Pokemon to just fucking bulk up on. I might as well even full restore me Shelly. While I'm at it, just in case. Should have done that first, obviously. No, yeah, done. Oh well. Oh, it would decide now, look, the lot's most powerful move. Probably crits me now, though. Nah, we're good. Oh, it didn't use me. Elsa? Shit. I might use on the next Pokemon if it lets me. I don't even know if you can do it mid battle. I've got one Ice Beam. To be fair, I'll be boost. That might be all I need. I know I'm gonna use Solar Beam and a Lapras. Right, I need Ice Beam here. What the fuck? Such a bitch move, man. We just need to wait for this to end. It did not spear me, of course. The boost it. It's gonna hit me five turns in a day. There we go. Solar Beam was pushing you on that, to be fair. Oh man. I think I need to surf it. Oh, it might not necessarily have Transform, of course. No worries. If I got a Hyper Beam now, I crit and I'm probably dead. Nice. I always forget it's random every time I see Ditto. <laughs> Why I was a bit like, oh, if it fucking. Transforms a copy just stats, I think. So that get all the boosts. Oh, the fucking lay crit from fucking Lapras of all, but fuck off. You know what? I won't reload. I'll try and plow through it. I'll go for the revive play. I've got no potions left though, so I still need to set up a. Uh, Thing. To be fair, the double edge, that's all it's gonna spam. We just set up withdrawals on this. No, it just keeps critting. It's two out of three. Lapras. A slow Pokemon, nice. Yeah, I'm fucking dead. I'm st I still have to beat it, man. Yeah, it's dead now, I'm sure. GG! Crit of my own. And we've done it, guys, at level 48. Oh, man. The lowest by far. It wasn't Arthur Q, no, it did need help from uh, Shelly, turned out. But not a great deal in the late 4, actually. But it did need its specials, of course, for the record. Price, congratulations, blah blah blah. Let's see this all in game time, of course. The real time we're going off to the video time, because of the sheer amount of time I save stated, which was a lot more in this run than any of the others. I would have fainted more in this run than any others. But good shit, man. Got through it in the end. Yeah, it wasn't the cleanest run by any means, but it didn't help if the Lapras got nerfed. I could have just run the fucking Lapras all game. If it, um, Blizzard had them in the pot. Shelly was a big find later on. Did bit. It's got the jinx. 229s in game time, even in game time was later, yeah, this will be towards the end, I think. Lower down. Check the description of the video, guys. I do leave the times of the previous ones. I still haven't full uploaded one. I, I will look into it, actually, so that when I am recording these, I know the times to be. Uh, I should be more prepared for that, but it will be next type. And speaking of types, now we are done with this. Let's back out. I'll save save just in case I do need to come back on this. Save. So what I'm going to do now is fetch open the 
log file and we will see where everything was. So I'll just scroll this so I will make this hard bigger. It makes the video use more megabyte and it takes longer to upload, which is always why I kind of leave it quite small. Um what did Arsecuno have at the start? I wonder. I wanna see if Thunderbolt like where the electric TMs were, like what they were. Mist Ice Punch Aurora Beam Egg Bomb. Yeah, I had that start. I would have learned double edge of fifty one. Blizzard fifty five ice beam. I already had them of course. It's all the trainers, what they are. So it is statics. God, one of them was mod. There was a mod present in um, power plant that had been level forty. Yeah, that have been decent for the fire on. Uh, so no, not too much. The Mewtwo is Goldeen. Snorlax. One of the Snorlaxes is Bulbasaur. We that's one we fought, isn't it? Yeah, the one was no, no, we fought Ghastly. Uh, Monchan was Paris, Lee was Dodo, Eevee was Nidoking. We pick up the Eevee. At that point, I still needed another Ice Pokemon. I guess I could have looked up where they were as well, like Jinx, but so be it, man. Fuck it. Doesn't matter now. Fun though was TM44. No clue where 44 is. I could Google it, but screw it. Uh, yeah, there was only one electric. It was Drill Pack at TM? I don't think it was. It's just unfortunate, man. Yeah, so many of these were physical moves, really. Plane Pro was, was a TM. That would have been nice, to be fair. Same with Body Slam. I skipped some of these things. Uh, they're all. Uh, game corner Pokemon. The fossil, we got Helix, we got Venusaur out of that. Uh, the Aerodactyl was Lickitung, the old Amber. Zapdos was Magikarp. <laughs> Fucking hell. Articuno, imagine the few. Articuno is far fetched. Um, so yeah, not, none of these were ice aside from the fucking Cloyster. So, the only one we went towards is literally perfect. Yeah, nothing. Are any of them even like Shelder or Seal? No. Cassid. There's always a fucking Caterpie in the game corner, man. I swear down. Every run. Uh, but yeah, that's it for that. So, um, what to do for the rest of the video, guys? Just to round off. Like always, let's see what the next challenge is going to be. What type it's going to be and what Pokemon we're going to be running. So, to recap now, I've done uh, episode 1 was electric, episode 2 was ground, episode 3 was water, and episode 4, I've got 900 tabs open at the moment, what the fuck? Episode 4 was ice, of course, when you've just watched. So, 11 types remain by my account. Let's have a look. Random, sorry, I have to just close all them tabs. Open random Pokemon generator. Show you right here. Stretch this. Generate one Pokemon from Kanto. All types. Bam. We've had electric, so on we go. We've had water, so on we go. Uh, we'll start getting longer to find one. We've had water. Fighting type. And we have Hitmonlee. Yes, boys. <laughs> oh, I love Hitmonlee. He's one of my favorite Pokemon, Hitmonlee. There's... No better fighting Pokemon, really. I'd say Machamp, maybe. They're kind of close. It, usually I'd lean towards Lee and Vanilla because of its moveset, but Machamp probably does have more attack. Um, but Lee definitely is the more attacking one of the two Hitmons. Chan is uh, more defensive, so I prefer having attack to just breach strength for it. But it'd be nice doing it with a physical Pokemon, like, like I said uh, earlier in this run. We had Nido Queen, it's the only other physical type we've had so far, ground, but I kind of balance it between physical and special. I'm just hoping 
the typing and the moves don't fuck up again because if I can't hit stuff with fighting then the Hitmonlee might as well just be like a slightly nerfed Tauros or Snorlax. Do you know what I mean? In that case I might go looking for the Machamp. Um so in terms of fighting Pokemon, yeah you have much that's it I think. Him on Lee, him on Chan. Machop. Machoke, Machamp. I can't think of another one right now in Gen 1. Fighting isn't really that common, so. Yeah, we don't have a small pool to go at. Um, I'll see if I can think of some more. Obviously, as far as the rival goes, yeah, I'll look that up now. It, it's going to be Psychic offline, I would have made it. I probably made Psychic the rival of Koga. Sabrina. So I probably made this rival of this. This is going to be the Chuck run, of course. He's the fighting specialist. I probably made that Falconer, I imagine, but I will check. Uh, Chuck. Oh no, it did make Sabrina our rival for this. Who the fuck's Koga's rival? In? Jasmine. Why is it Jasmine? Oh, because the poison can't hit the steel. Jasmine would literally be immune to his poison attack. And his spores and stuff. Yeah, fair enough. That makes sense. Uh, so yeah, it's going to be Chuck. And I'm going to go with Rival. Oh, God. So what to do, guys? You give the Rival the best Psychic Pokemon. The best Pokemon of the other type. Do I give the Rival Mewtwo? I might have to, man. It is broken. It'll be the hardest run easily. Uh, should I just give it Alakazam? Mewtwo's kind of busted. I, when it comes to Psychic, I'm allowed to use Mewtwo if I find it. I've still not actually found Mewtwo in any run, it's funny. Um, just in a wild. Uh, yeah. I'll give the rival and Mewtwo. Fucking hell, it's going to be so hard. So Sabrina has a Mewtwo. <laughs> okay, I'll be next challenge up then, guys. Um, be up in a few days, at least, I imagine. Uh, stay tuned. Hope you enjoyed this one anyway. I'll leave the final time and the details of the run in the description below. GG.